Fallout 4 is a game rated M by the ESRB. Hello and welcome back to more Steven Plays Fallout 4. On the last episode, we finally made our way to Diamond City! Briefly, very, very briefly, but we decided that it would be more pressing because realistically, if we put ourselves in, in Grit Jones shoes, it is to come take care of kidnapping at Oberlin Station. Uh, one of the settlers was taken to Backstreet Apparel, and that is where we are now. Um, you guys are getting this video late, and for that I apologize. I am a little under the weather, and I wanted to briefly talk about that. This will be the first and probably only time I mention this specifically, but um, the show will go on. If I am sick, uh, but still capable of recording Fallout, I will continue to record Fallout. This just kind of keeps in principle with the idea of doing them one at a time. With other series, I can record ahead, and I can get ahead, so it doesn't matter if I get sick or not. But when it comes to Fallout, I may get sick. And when I get sick, I will probably continue to record if I have a voice. Uh, yesterday, I was just too ill to get it ready for today. Today, I'm feeling a little bit better, so I am working on Fallout 4. I did this for Skyrim. Um, so it should be no surprise for anyone who watched that series. There were a few times where I recorded while sick. Eventually I'll get better, and things will go back to normal. Um, before we go too far, I wanted to say a quick shout-out. First off, to everyone who works on the Steven Wiki, because they're awesome people. But specifically for Kenny134, for taking the piece of information I gave at the end of last episode and turning it into a useful chart. If you go over to the link in the description, um, hopefully I'll remember to actually put that there. You guys can see, um... You know, the chart that Kenny made, it basically shows uh, all of the uh, quests that I have done in relation to the episodes that they happened. It's just really helpful. So today, we are going to be going through here and trying to, um, trying to figure out exactly what we need. So this is good. Yes. Thank you. We also get to save somebody who presumably are here. Let me go ahead and equip that because I know if I don't... If I don't, I won't. So this is just nothing but improvements. So let's go ahead and equip that thing. Is this improvement? Eh, it's plus or minus. All right. Also, someone in the comments said that there's a bowler hat in here. Is that guy shaking? He's shaking a little bit. It's been creepier. <laughs> there's been some creepier stuff I've seen in like Skyrim, and then also I guess in Fallout. So that's not too bad. If there's a bowler hat, I'd like to find it. People have been telling me for. I don't know how long, almost since the beginning of the uh, series, that Codsworth can wear a bowler hat. Apparently he can't wear all hats, but he can wear a bowler hat. Codsworth. So what I need to do is go into my apparel here and give him the bowler hat. Then I need to go over to his apparel and make him equip it. Oh my god. I be of service. Codsworth, you are beautiful. I love it. I absolutely love it. Um, hopefully we'll, we'll get some fan art that reflects the change here. Uh, Alright, so let's continue to walk around and see what we can find. Clothes hanger, farmhand clothes. I don't know if clothes hangers would be of any use. Maybe steel, aluminum, something like that. Uh, there's still plenty of other people in here to kill. And that's exciting. Um, but there's also... Is that term? Oh, I can see right through that terminal, so it's not something I can check. Don't see anything in here... <laughs> More clothes hangers, cash register, clothes hanger. I don't know. I'll take those. Someone's around here. I don't know where they are exactly, but they're really close by. Be careful, Codsworth. We're gonna have trouble real soon. <laughs> or, you know, just do your thing. Doesn't make a lot of noise when I open doors, which is odd. Is this a... Oh, this must, uh, this must have been like a, um, uh, what do you call it? A dressing room. It's weird, I haven't seen a dressing room quite this fancy. Another dressing room? Dressing rooms generally don't have this much blood in them, um. <laughs> but, you know, the world of Fallout. Let's go to the left here. Nope. Let's go a little bit further. Yeah, there we go. Um, some people will, uh, inquire, as they did in Skyrim, you know. Oh, hey! Please, you gotta help me! Shut up! Don't worry, I'm here to rescue you. Oh my god! Thank you! Let's go! Report back. Let's trade. Of course. <laughs> I can take your stuff! I'm worried that you're gonna get killed 
That's the only problem. I should have maybe told you to just stay here. Because I would like to look around this place. There's a stealth boy in the metal bucket. Um, anyway, what I was saying... So now I'm detected, but it's, it's by a friendly. I'm gonna take these people out. Um, is that, uh... You know, I do get, I do get sick from time to time, and I will be, um... Continuing to record. Uh, and like I said, if, if I can record, like if I have a voice to record, I probably will. There's actually a few episodes that probably sound... Where my voice sounds quite funny, um, in... Uh, Skyrim because of that. There's gotta be someone in here. Get him! Or I will. We're still in danger. They're upstairs, we're good. Alright, what you got on you? Stim pack, switchblade. Careful. They're coming. Where are they? The danger's leaving. They're still looking, though. I'm gonna finish this up. Where you at? Gotcha! Boom, baby! Dead before he even hit her. I think. Maybe. I wanna keep the settler safe. Um, Codsworth, you're in the way. If you could just move a little bit. Thank you, that will work. Boom! We still in danger? Still in danger. Who else is here? There's still one left. Where are you, you slimy son of a gun? Yeah, just stand there casually. Let me know how it works out for you. <laughs> My name is Grit Jones, and you have met Baby. Okay, everyone's dead. Good. Now we can, uh, now we can just take our time. It's a lot nicer. Strengthen the... Uh, yeah, that's nice. I mean that. Once again, go ahead and put these things on, because if I don't, um, I will forget. And that will be bad. Let's put that on. Canned dog food, and I'm good. Now, if Wilma was here, you'd probably appreciate that. Did you have anything else? No, you didn't. There's probably more stuff around here. I want to make sure that, um... Oh, a pack of duct tape. I want to make sure that I don't rush it. Uh, I'm pretty good about taking my time, as you guys are very well aware of at this point. And I want to make sure that just because I run in and start taking people out, that, that doesn't mean that I miss something. Because uh, that would be tragic. That would be absolutely tragic. What do you got over here? Oh, man! That's how that guy died! They- they killed someone by throwing him in the bathtub and then throwing a toaster in with them. That's just- I don't know, they're- Even like, tiny, tiny mini-stories. I know that we did the, uh, Edwin and Annika thing, which is a little bit longer. But even like, seeing stuff like that, it's just really neat. So this is gonna be our, uh, this is gonna be our exit. Uh, I'm gonna go back down and explore this place a little bit. Cause I betcha there's some other goodies that we should grab. Got this thing open. Yes. Cutting fluid, duct tape. Flip blader and paintbrush. And that sends me off to uh, level 11, which is nice. Uh, if we want, we can still continue to build our strength. It allows us to carry more. Um, let me take a quick look at it. I don't think there was anything else I really wanted to do. Um, I'm worried that it's something. No, well, we have. Okay, so we could still get expert terminals. We may want that. I'm gonna hold on to it. Just until, uh, just until we leave this place to see if there's a terminal here. But if there's not, we'll, um, we'll probably just, uh, use it on strength again. Another stim pack. Canned dog food. Anything back here? Another bucket of wine. An extinguisher. She's probably like, can we go? And I'm like, well, not yet. <laughs> I just want to look around and take all the dog food. Lots of people that died. Tactical hardened submachine gun. Let's see what this stuff is exactly. Silver pocket watch, yes, squirrel bits. Um, do we have something that uses 45 ammo? I'm not entirely sure we do. Uh, either way, I can I can take it and scrap it. It's just heavy. Although I can carry it right now, can I? What was the metal right leg? So it gives us less. Uh. Yeah, sure. 
I'll carry it for now. I can always get rid of this stuff or deal with it later. Tire iron. There's quite a few people that died right here in the hallway. Okay, we're good. Can we go that way? No, I suppose not. Alright, back downstairs. Take a quick look around. So this is the room I went into. This probably got some lore. And uh, I was worried that this could be expert level. That's why I didn't use my perk quite yet. Uh, let's do Wicked. Likeness 1. Uh, reward? Likeness 1. Learned? Oh, God. It has to be TV. Nice. Woo! Man, that one was hard. Safe control. Locked? Disengage lock. Um, before we disengage lock... Well, thank you, Codsworth. I appreciate the moral support. I was going to uh, see how hard it was to hack... ...to uh, to open this thing myself first. Where is the... Where is the safe? I actually don't see a safe. There's an armor workbench. Oh, here's the safe. Advance. Yeah, I think I can probably do this myself and get the experience off of this twice. Which I will gladly do. Get me ever closer to level 12. Uh, let's take all that stuff. Thank you very much. Desk fan. Uh, oh, there's some good stuff in here. Boom, boom. What is this? Tactical light pipe bolt action pistol. Nah, I'm good. Lightweight metal chest piece. Um... Better ballistics, less energy. I'll just take it. Worry about it later. Try and figure something out. I'm sure I'll get better, um, just armor in general because I'm working towards armor. That's one of the things I'm doing. What is it? What is that? Compensated armor piercing automatic pistol, I guess. Sure, let's take it along. Anything else? Nope. Okay, right arm bones. Yes. Grit loves arms. It's his favorite thing. Uh, any of this stuff? They're using metal chest pieces. Uh, nope. Pretty much, pretty much killed all these guys. Wooden spoon. Uh, here's a sniper rifle. It's a, uh, pipe bolt action sniper rifle. I'm, I'm increasing my weight, but I'm also almost done here. So I guess I, I don't care as much. This cooler is locked. Why is the cooler locked? Someone didn't want their Sunny D stolen. Let's pop this sucker open. I guess I need to go further. There we go. Nice. Uh, corn. Someone didn't want their corn stolen. Are you serious right now? Someone didn't want their corn to go away? Yeah, okay, whatever. Toilet. Rib cage. Yeah, rib cage. Uh, right arm bones, another behind the door. What? <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Um, there is there is no part of me that does not absolutely love this. All right, uh, you little guy are coming with me. The paper can stay here. Anything else around? No, I think we're good. Okay, what's in there? Oh, it's soap. Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure pretty sure we took care of everything. Um, we walked, we walked through, we saved the person, they came with us, all is well. Um, the only thing left to do, really, that I can think of is go out through the roof, because there's apparently something out there, so... Come with me, settler, I'm gonna take you back to Oberland. I will be your savior, and everything will be fine. These guys were really no match for Grit Jones and Bowler wearing... Bowler hat wearing Codsworth, which is the best type of Codsworth. I don't think he can wear anything else. If you can, let me know. I would love to dress up Codsworth. It seems likely that that's the only thing, though. Alright, we're all set. Let's head back to the Fens. Okay, uh, we're up on the roof. No one's out here at all, I guess. Kind of using vats to take a look around. There's... What's interesting is that there's actually, um... There's lights. I don't see anyone over there. There's some textures really trying to figure out what to do. Should we load? No, no, no. So partially load? No, no, no. Give up. Uh, it doesn't seem like there's anything else uh, of interest to me out here besides the steady bear and a grenade and two cocktails. Thank you very much. Um, 
It's never too late. Vault shelter. Back alley bowling. Now, could you jump down or... Probably not. Actually, I don't even... To be honest, I don't need to jump down. I can fast travel straight to, um... I can fast travel si straight to Oberland, right? Let's do that now. Alrighty, I am back. Um... Where are you? Are you asleep? Where's the girl? And why is this thing floating in the air? So many questions. Uh, you must be asleep. Hi! Oh, you- oh, good timing, you just woke up. Hey. <clears throat> I don't know how to thank you for that rescue you pulled off. Um, yeah. You're welcome. It's good to know we can count on the Minutemen when we need them. 101 bottle caps. Where is your friend? She's not here. That's concern. I'm sure it's fine. So we completed that quest. You guys were telling me that um, these sorts of quests are radiant quests. Same thing from Skyrim. And basically, they are never ending. Stuff will always be happening. We will always have to go deal with it. I will probably only be showing one of each type of thing. So, like, this was a kidnapping and I showed it. If something, if a different type of thing goes wrong, then uh, I'll take the time to show it. But otherwise, I won't be showing every single time there's a kidnapping because it sounds like it might get a little repetitive. Um, so, let's take a look here. So, we got Story of the Century, Out of the Fire, Troubled Waters, Fire Support, and Jewel of the Commonwealth. So, quite a few things that we could do. Um, honestly, the one that's oldest, besides this, I guess, this is older, is probably Troubled Waters. Um, that's... I, I wouldn't mind going to do that. Uh, where is that? Oh! It's that thing. I can see it from here. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm going to head back to Sanctuary briefly, just so we can drop some stuff off, and then it looks like we're going to be heading to the water treatment plant. Having dumped my stuff at the, uh, at settle- at, at the settlement of Sanctuary, I've come back down to, uh, the Beantown Brewery, show you guys exactly where I am. I need to get over here. I need to take not this bridge, but the other bridge, and then walk around. I could swim across, but that seems like not something I want to do. Also, can I even go? Uh, <laughs> you know what, Codsworth? This bridge seems fine. I love this bridge. This is my favorite bridge. Oh, there's something neat over there. I'm like, whoa. Yeah. I'm like a dog, man. I'm, I'm walking around and then I see a squirrel. I gotta go check out that squirrel because that squirrel might <laughs> have caps. You know what I'm saying? Is there anybody over here? A random car chilling here. Oh, God. All right, um, let's pop a, uh, let's pop a Rad X. Makes the most sense, probably. Okay, that'll help a lot. All right, can we get in here? It's locked, but we can. I don't know what's in here, but, uh, hopefully we'll find goodies and not the, the opposite. Got it. Baddies. What you got in here? Oh, oh, God. Mirelurk hatchlings? Oh god, that seems bad. Boom! Now he's on fire. It's a good one. Jesus. There's another one. There's more over there. Codsworth, I should really have you do this sort of thing because you're the one that can't be affected by radioactivity. Knuckles. Anything here? Double barrel shotgun. That doesn't help me. Gotta be something of interest here. Oh, here we go. Whoa, what is this? Cushioned, treated, leather left leg? Yes! And lightweight, tempered, raider chest piece? Eh, nah. Marksman's powerful pipe rifle. Ported, tuned, uh, pipe bolt action pistol. That's pretty neat. And psycho. Is there anything else in here? Keeping an eye on that, that radiation. Okay, uh, so that was a lot of, uh, radiation poisoning. Like, a ridiculous amount. In fact, if I even look that way, I start getting sick again. I don't think I missed anything, but I was also kind of in a rush, you know, to, like, not die. Uh, where's my rat away? 
I have just about 300 exactly, so that'll be perfect. And I brought, uh, I brought a lot of food with me. So, let's see, what can I snack on? Grilled rad roach, perfect. Alright, uh, back to, uh, to what I was doing. So I need to head that way, because I need to get back over to that... Well, I'm not even going to that bridge, I'm just, I'm actually walking around it. I have no idea what we're gonna find. Hopefully it's gonna be good stuff. There's a couch. We don't even have to visit the Ikea, we can just get that one. Some of the cars are, like, completely scrapped, and the other ones are not. Also, this is like a bad omen, man. There's so many birds, what... What are you guys doing here? And why are none of you scared of anything? Why? Sometimes I randomly run into the birds and they're like, invincible. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, here's something. What's this? Oh, good. Corpses. Uh, squirrel on a stick? Yeah, I'll pass. Poor the diner. Oh, man. <laughs> um... We almost had it. Oh man, I really want that... That piece of pie. This is ridiculous. Can, give another shot there. Give that- you- you got it this time. It's not happening. Okay, well, let's... Let's move on. This is all ridiculous. Uh, there we go. A pistol. Pulaski Preservation Shelter. There could possibly be something in here. Maybe the people were in here when the bombs fell, and then after the explosion stopped, they got out and they died of, of radiation sickness, like, immediately. Oh, hey, you're in here, and you're also out here. You're in both places at once. Can I get on this bus? Alright, cool. Uh, bobby pin, gray knit cap. Anything up front? Really just came in here for the bobby pin. Oh, look! Look what we have here. A grenade and a cocktail. Someone was packing, man. Red X has worn off, but we don't need it now. I think I've seen this before. Um, things refill after a while, but I'm pretty sure I actually did get that before we, um... Before we even were at Oberlin Station the first time. Didn't look like there's anything in there. And if we follow this, I think that over there, that big circle... ...thing, is, um... ...is what we're after. I think that's the treatment plant. I assume that we'll run into robots? For whatever reason, that just seems like the kind of thing that... ...we'd, we'd see there, but I, I guess I really don't know. Sweater vest and slacks? If I want to look fabulous. I can't imagine that doing much for me. Black vest and slacks. Uh, yeah, these are all clever. And you know what? I, I think I actually am going to take these because I'm going to make my, my settlers wear them. Because I think that would be funny. I'll just have people that are not armored at all, but they, they look great. They look fantastic. Jeez. I'm sure there's a way to, to get everywhere. Shut up, Codsworth. You're my buddy. You work for me, pal. Now, if I had to guess, this is it. This is the thing that was across the water, and Oberland is somewhere up on that hill. I don't know if we're going to run into any sort of opposition over here. It's still hidden. Things are looking pretty good right now. Okay. Now would probably be a good time to do some, uh... Some ska- Oh! You guys. I'm in caution. How far can they see? Not far enough. That one's gone. Oh, God. So... They've got some sort of rocket launcher. That's, um... That's really bad. Uh, let's go ahead and stim pack. Seems like a good move. Run! Ugh. Okay, now that I'm feeling better... Uh, food. We need to eat... Sure, death claw steak. Sounds yummy. I'm under caution, they're looking for me. This is bad. They've got... Probably a missile launcher. I also have a missile launcher. I was actually fortunate enough to find one last episode, I just don't have any missiles. Ha! You missed, idiot! 
You're not going to be missing soon. What's that? What's that sound? I'm in danger. Of course I'm in danger. Oh god! Those guys! You guys told me about those guys. Mal's told me about those guys too. They're guys, they're super mutants that are suicide bombers. They run forward with um, bombs in their hands. And if you don't kill them before they get to you, you're screwed. I've never actually seen one, but I heard that ticking noise and I'm like, I bet that's what that is. Nuclear material. Oh, he's just sitting there with his little bowler hat. Hi, buddy. How's it going? Well, this is unfortunate. I don't seem to be hitting you. Execute critical. Got you that time. Keep running forward if you dare. Are you the one with the missile launcher? Not really hit- I am hitting you, actually. There's a better way to do this. Ouch! Yeah, that sucks, huh? You are not doing a very good job hitting me. I am using a rifle. You are using a machine gun. If I could be hidden again, that would be helpful, but that's probably not going to happen at the moment. What do you throw? That's a pretty good shot! That's pretty good! God, there's a lot of them. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Alright. It's time to, uh... It's time to look into some alternative things here. How about... How about a frag grenade? That seems like a good idea. That's one. Where's the other one? What do you have, by the way? A missile launcher! Okay, I'll take your missile launcher. I don't know if that's gonna give me ammo for it or not. That would be convenient. Who is around? Just you and you? You guys actually aren't all that difficult. Come on, baby. You're getting sniped by baby. Gotcha. Okay, um... Jesus. Okay, Henry back out. It's a good shot. Another good shot. Come on, go down already. We're still in danger. Who's still here? Who in... Oh, of course. Alright, let's go pay that guy a visit. That seems like a good idea. Uh, noodle cup. Let's see. Purified water. Let's just do that, because I don't need much health right now. Things are looking pretty good. Um, I took out some guys. Of course, that was the- that was- that was the back way, man. It's hard to tell- it's hard to tell what kind of mess we're about to get ourselves in. There's gonna be a lot of super mutants in here, though. I also saw a dog briefly, but then I didn't see it again. I guess Codsworth dealt with it. Where's the front door of this place? Any sign of life over here? No, it looks- looks okay over here. Can't get in that. Actually, how do we... How do we get in? Where is it that... Oh, it, I think it's over there. Okay, first off. That guy doesn't know where we are again. He's over here, right? Oh, he moved. Okay, no problem. I'm ready. I'm willing. We can play. Just don't know where that guy went. That isn't revealing his location. But it looks like this is how we get over there. And also we have to... We have to swim. Oh, I'm in caution. Where are you going, buddy? Where you no, I'm hidden again. I'm hidden again. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Wait for it. That was a miss! Doggone it! Let's go, Codsworth. I don't stand... stand down to anyone. Oh, that's a lot of the rads. That's a lot of the rads. Go, go, go! Get back here! Codsworth, get him! Doggone it! Where'd you go, boy? No, really, where, where did he... Where did he go? Codsworth, you got him? 
Codsworth? Do, do you get him? The, the red dot's still there, Codsworth. You, Codsworth, you're really blowing it. Codsworth, you had one job. Did you do it? It was that bowler hat, wasn't it? Gave you strength. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Next episode, it seems likely we'll be going into the plant? If that's if that's a thing we can do. I don't actually know if there's an entrance. I assume there is. Um, and we'll be taking a look at this area because this is this is where the The what some of me Oh come on! You didn't kill him, Codsworth! Codsworth! One job! You had one job! You know what? You know what? Give me, give me the bowler hat. Give me the bowler hat. You have lost privileges. Wait, what? What? Codsworth. Codsworth, you still have the bowler hat on. Codsworth, why do you still have the... Never mind. Uh, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, next episode, we will we'll deal with this. Apparently, I will, because Codsworth will just leave and be like, eh, he's, he's more than 10 feet away, so everything's fine. Uh, also, I am on the road to recovery, so I should be feeling much better next episode. At least, I hope so. Uh, we'll be dealing with this, and then uh, you guys can let me know what you want to see next. I heard that Finch Farm is kind of difficult. I don't know if we're quite ready to, to jump into that yet. Um, we might want to just go explore Diamond City for a bit, because obviously there's still a lot to do there. And certainly Piper's Office and Valentine's Detective Agency, those are both in Diamond City. Might be a good way to spend some time. Also, I kind of want to spend my level up on strength, but just in the event that there's a terminal coming up, looks like there is a doorway over there, so we might need to hack an expert terminal, so I'll just wait on it. But that's what I'll probably be using that point on soon. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time for more Stephen Plays Fallout 4.